Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So usually I have quite good positive videos on my channel, but today, no, 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 no. So today I want to talk to you about this handbag from Ted Baker. I love this handbag from Ted Baker. Like, I think it is the best thing in the world. I thought it was pretty, it's beautiful. I've had it for a while. And unfortunately, somebody bought it me and I cannot physically find the receipt and I believe he paid cash. So I'm pretty much stuck with my problem. Now, I understand that you need some form of receipt to take something back that you are not 100% satisfied with. But this is the big ball. These bags aren't cheap. I believe this was either £110 or £120. I can't quite remember. But this, this is my going out bag. This is my barely used bag. I mean, look at it. This is the bottom of it. There's no feet. But do you see it dirty? No. It's immaculate. There's absolutely nothing wrong with how I treated this bag. And I have complained and basically without receipt or anything, you can't do anything about it. And I think that's wrong for this reason. So when you open up the bag, it's actually, I am going to get this on camera for you guys. Let me see. Can you see here? It's split in and it's not just this side. It's this side as well. Now, I have only used this bag a handful of times because it's not your average everyday going out bag. It's a posh handbag that I, I consider it posh anyway. I've got more expensive bags than this, but I just, I love the pattern on it. And I'm not impressed in the slightest. I don't believe if you're paying this kind of money for a bag that it should just randomly split. So then it got me thinking, if I've spotted that, what else have I missed? Now, I sent pictures to Ted Baker and I still got told there is nothing they can do without a receipt. And I was like, but your quality is shocking on this bag and I have never, I mean, right. So I own, in fact, I have owned probably five, maybe six bags. I own a pair of gloves from them and I've also purchased a coat from them. I have purchased ooh, four purses, I believe, and I've never had an issue with anything. And I think that's the thing. Your name should come up with what you have put. I know it's obviously if someone else has bought it, you like my gloves wouldn't come because if someone else had bought it me. But I was then looking, I mean, the strap, I've still got the strap for it. The strap is immaculate. Everything on this bag is immaculate. That's how little it's been used. And then I spotted this. Okay, so on the back where the hood, lid, whatever. I'm going to get this on camera and all. don't know how. It's ripped a hole. Where obviously it's opening up, there's a hole. And I was like, oh my god, this, obviously the stitching has gone through the material. And now it's actually ripping. It's also split. <laughs> Let me get that back on camera. So they've got a hole there and it's also split in here. Look, I can give them a nail through it. And, oh, this is so hard to do. It's done it on the other side as well. I'm like absolutely disgusted. Like, I might as well just bend it back now because obviously they're not going to give me a full refund for it. But if I bend it back, which I'm not impressed with because I've never done this before at all. Look. But I'm not allowed to exchange my bag because of the poor quality of it because I haven't got a receipt, which I understand. But it's just shocking. I can't believe that it's split and there's nothing I can do about it. So I just wanted to do a bit of a rant video. I have never, I'm going to put this out there, I've never had a problem with Ted Baker before, ever. But I'm absolutely disgusted in this because I have not used this enough. I have a Ted Baker bag for work. I cram it in a locker. It's got marks all over it. It's grey and it's literally ditched. 
anything better Nick than this and I'm absolutely disgusted because I can't keep using this I mean do I try and sell it and maybe make five quid on it or do I just use it until it falls to bits but then it is absolutely no good whatsoever so I'm unsure and I'm heartbroken because I loved that design to the point that I actually think I want the bedding in this but I'm just really disappointed because I expect more from Ted Baker and I do understand you need a receipt but when something looks this immaculate and it's ripped there's something just not quite right. So anyway, I just wanted to have a rant about my fave. This is one of my favourite bags. And I'm absolutely gutted because I don't know what to do now. I don't know whether just to use it or not. I really don't know. But anyway, I'm sorry for the rant video today. There will be a better video in a couple of days. If you have made it this far and you did like this video, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. We still like a good rant every so often. Click over here. To subscribe if you haven't already click over in the top corner to check out one of my latest videos and click in the bottom corner to see a video that youtube has selected for you i'd like to thank you for watching take care i'll see you in a few days with another video and bye bye